Thank you for watching my video about hammer voicing. Today I'm going to make a demonstration of the way that a piano can be improved by a simple process called hammer voicing. I'm going to demonstrate a before and after process. I'm going to let you listen to a scale uh, where these hammers are sounding brassy and loud and uneven and very unpleasant. And using these tools, I'm going to voice those hammers. This is a sanding paddle. This will sand the layers of old felt off and sand the grooves out and allow easy, uh, even contact between the strings and the hammer. And this needle tool will soften the fibers of the felt, therefore allowing the hammers to produce a soft melatonin similar to the way the piano would have sounded when it was new. So here's the sound of bad voiced hammers. Welcome back. Now we're going to listen to the sound of the hammers after they've been voiced. Now doesn't that sound better? Welcome back again. Now I'm going to give you yet another example of excellent voicing on this piano here. So listen to this and compare it to the other two samples that we uh, had on the previous piano. So that's another example of very good voicing. I'm just going to play a few chords on this piano. Just help you get a feeling for a good voicing. Now I'd like to say something about the need for having a properly voiced piano. First of all, it's not only about making your piano sound good. If you're a piano student or you have a piano student in your family, the teacher is going to want that that student has the ability to play at different volumes and also to play evenly. That's such an essential part of music, playing at different volumes, which we call dynamics, and having the notes play evenly from note to note. If the notes don't play evenly from one to the next, it is almost impossible, possibly impossible, for some students to learn how to control the evenness of the music. Also, the student will, may never uh, get a grasp of uh, the concept of volume in music where uh, compositions often have a soft uh, section, a medium section, a loud, and a very loud. Poorly voiced hammers typically will only produce loud sounds and maybe medium loud sounds if best, but not at all soft. And so much of piano music requires some delicate uh, delicate sounds and uh, old hard hammers are incapable of doing that. So I suggest that uh, you have your piano technician speak with you about voicing your piano. Voicing is, is very affordable and it can be done in a relatively short while. So thanks for listening to my uh, video on uh, hammer voicing.